Yes, I think Jordan Peterson's conclusions are terrific. His foundation is weak. I think that the edifice he has built on his presuppositions. I would love to get together with him one day because I love right. his. I will uh, see if I can make it happen. Could you do that? Uh, yeah, my I, it would be an honor because I, I mean, the way he was treated at Cambridge, you know, and his plan to go there is, is totally uh, unlikable. What exactly? I mean, an educational institution to do that to a man of his repute and his capability. Mm -hmm. Christian evangelist Ravi Zacharias has never enrolled at the University of Cambridge. He merely audited classes there for one semester in 1990. This has not stopped him from telling fans and donors that he was educated in Cambridge and from claiming that he studied under various renowned Cambridge scholars who he refers to as my professors. I studied at Cambridge for some time. Uh, one of my professors of quantum theory there, John Pokinghorn. I remember in my days at Cambridge studying under a quantum physicist, John Pokinghorn. I studied under John Pokinghorn at Cambridge University. My professor of quantum, John Pokinghorn at Cambridge University. My work in Cambridge University was in the Romantic Poets. In my studies in English literature at Cambridge. I, I studied at Cambridge. Doing my studies at Cambridge. Under the philosophy department at Cambridge. My work at Cambridge. My days at Cambridge. Cambridge. My days at Cambridge. My days at Cambridge. Cambridge University. Imagine being in the most, one of the most prestigious universities in the world, having the most prestigious philosophy department. I went there, I studied under them. The University of Oxford has stated that Mr. Zacharias was never an employee of the university and that he has never held any formal position there. Mr. Zacharias nevertheless informs his fans and donors that he was an official lecturer at Oxford and sometimes calls himself a professor at Oxford, as we see in this clip here. Now I'm a professor at Oxford. I hope nobody quotes me, but Cambridge is prettier than Oxford. <laughs> Ravi Zacharias has built an international self-named empire on these deceptions, one that generates $35 million a year, and he wants more. Don't support deception, don't support arrogance, don't support Ravi Zacharias. Please share this video with your unsuspecting Christian friends before they are duped by God's great apologist. A Friendly Banjo Atheist Production.